Yo, welcome back, welcome back. You already know who it is. It's your boy, Made Man Mello, coming to you back live with some more Kitchen Impact trailer reactions. Today, we're taking a look at your boy, the artiste, Albedo Fry the Prince. If that's how you say it, if not, please help me out because I don't want to butcher it anymore. We're taking a look at the collective miscellany. We're taking a look at how his moves is going to be incorporated into the game and what he's going to bring to a table which it looks like it's going to be very good. So let's go and take a look. The city of Pastorals, Mondstadt, is as free as the wind. Even an outsider like Albedo, Albedo. can become chief alchemist of the Knights of Favonius. Okay. But on the other hand, his mastery of alchemy means that no one ever would have taken much persuading. Mondstadt was never a nation known for its alchemy. But since Albedo's arrival, the knight's achievements in the field sit only behind those of Sumeru's top scholars. Knights and academics. Not two words that one would expect to hear in the same sentence. Fresh. Geo. Instead of leading the charge in combat, the calm and collected Albedo is better suited to providing support with reliable geo damage. Still, his skill set allows him to deal powerful attacks, meaning he more than holds his own on the battlefield. Ooh, I can't wait to face him. Creation is the basis of alchemy. Albedo's knowledge allows him to find ways to improve crafting recipes and make better use of materials. When crafting weapon ascension materials, he has a chance of doubling the crafting output. Okay. Albedo's normal attack can combo up to five strikes with his sword. Holding the attack button consumes a certain amount of stamina and performs two swift forward slashes. Tap his elemental skill to create a solar isotoma using alchemy, dealing area of effect geo damage. A field is created around the solar isotoma. That's a big Periodically, field. when an enemy within the field takes damage, a transient blossom is generated at the enemy's location. The transient blossom scales off Albedo's defense, dealing AoE geo damage to surrounding enemies. A transient blossom can only be generated once every two seconds. Okay. Additionally, Not bad. making contact with the solar isotoma causes geo energy to accumulate, forming a crystallized platform that lifts the character up to a certain height. Only one platform can exist at a time. Okay. Not bad. Strategic use of the crystallized platform lets you employ plunging attacks in battle and helps you deal with enemies up above. When adventuring, hold Albedo's elemental skill to choose the solar isotoma's position and use the crystallized platform to get past environmental obstacles more quickly. Always helps. After unlocking the talent Calcite Might, transient blossoms deal extra damage against enemies with low health. Okay, all right. Crystallized geo energy bursts forth at Albedo's command, that move dealing is AOE be tough. geo damage in front of Albedo. If Albedo's solar isotoma is still present on the battlefield, seven fatal blossoms are generated in the solar isotoma field, which bloom aggressively. They make it look so good. AOE though. geo damage. They make it look so good. After unlocking the talent Homuncular Nature, Albedo's elemental burst increases nearby party members' elemental mastery for a period of time. Okay. I definitely want that. Albedo's skill set is a rare and invaluable asset in combat. Creative use of the solar isotoma greatly diversifies the battle, paving like the a beastly way support to certain victory. Feel like a beastly support. When the battle begins, create a solar isotoma with Albedo's elemental skill. As he and fellow party members attack enemies inside the solar isotoma field. Transient blossoms appear and deal damage to enemies. Okay, now that's tough. Okay, that, that's that's tough. Reactions. Solar isotoma also enables party members to unleash plunging attacks. Okay, that's tough. When energy is that's, full, that's have nice. Albedo unleash an elemental burst, giving the whole party a performance boost with increased elemental mastery. Okay. No one can dispute Albedo's talent, but the source of the knowledge he possesses, it once brought about the destruction of a glorious nation. 
All that most people know of him is his title, Kreide Prince. Kreide Prince. And that he gained his position in the Knights on recommendation from Alice, the adventurer. Beyond this, the young man is a stranger to them, a complete mystery. And the essence of his knowledge is equally unknown. But I know it well. It hails from Kanria, the art of Chemia. Artist. Soil and chalk, the universe and earth, pure dust and the birth of human life. There is no mistaking it. I am content to watch most crises play out from the sidelines. But if Albeda were ever to make a single wrong move, I could not let myself ignore it. Hmm, I wonder who's speaking. Have have it have y'all figured that out who who does the the speaking because it seems like he's he's the character. Is that somebody that we already have? Cause it sounds familiar. And he's talking like if my if my dog do something, he gonna do something about it. Like he 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 overlooking him, overwatching him and stuff like that. Um Mysterious. But he looks like a good, good support character. Definitely looks good. I might, you know, get get in that uh little trial run of him, see how he works. You know, hey, can't have too many team rotations. I'm still trying to solidify my one rotation so far. I, I got an extra character from some draws and stuff, and I kind of like that character. And I'm still trying to get Zongli. Hopefully I get him. Please let me get my dog. I just I just want my dog. That's all. After I did that trial, I want him. Okay? Thank you. Thank you for tuning in. This is your boy, Made Man Mellow. You guys have a wonderful, wonderful day. Peace.